Allegedly attacked by an Uber driver, spoke out today as he filed a legal claim in the case. KTV's David Stevenson reports this comes as cab drivers lashed out at the ride-sharing industry as a whole. Angry San Francisco cab drivers rallied outside Uber's offices this morning, frustrated by what they say is an unregulated rideshare market that is killing the taxi industry. The market is oversaturated with drivers and nobody's able to make a living. Uber today also came under fire from a client who says he was brutally attacked by a driver. Using Uber at the end of the night is supposed to be a... Uh, the responsible, safe thing to use when you're out with friends. Instead, 35-year-old San Francisco bartender Roberto Chica says his Uber driver struck him with a claw hammer two weeks ago after a dispute about the best way to reach a destination point. And they're not sure whether I'm going to lose my eye or not, or even regain vision. The driver, 26-year-old Patrick Caraja, has pled not guilty to battery and assault with a deadly weapon and is out on $125,000 bail. Chica's attorney says Uber is dodging liability and responsibility for the act of its drivers. An Uber spokeswoman today described drivers as independent contractors and said, quote, this was a deplorable incident and we wish Mr. Chica's a quick recovery. Uber's insurance provider is in contact with representatives of both the rider and driver. And of course, we will continue to cooperate with authorities throughout the investigation to just wake up and have doctors hovering over you was probably one of the scariest things I've ever experienced Karaja's attorney did not return our call today he's due back in court on November 4th in San Francisco David Stevenson KTVU Channel 2 News more details now just last month the governor signed a law requiring rideshare companies to carry at least fifty thousand dollars of liability insurance in the event a driver injures or kills someone on the street and a million dollars in coverage is required to cover uber passengers the changes come in response to the death of six-year-old sophia Liu, who was hit by an uber driver in san francisco last new year's eve while crossing the street with her family during an nfl owners meeting